Let's start. Everybody who wants to know more about esports, please come to Pitch Session. Come on, let's give a cheer. Let's have a good Pitch Session here. Uh, so, uh, let me speak about our company. Our company is called Eloplay and it's working operational esports platform. So, here's opportunity for you to know more about esports, to know more about the market and to know more about the innovational product which we actually present to you. So, what we present to you is eSports platform. We are a startup from Estonia. We are a young company and we are making uh, products for winners. We make products for players who want to win and for brands and companies who want to enter eSports market and win as well. So it's uh, for winners and who want to make something innovative, to join something innovation and join something special in the market. And in our project, we introduce some cool things. First of all, we uh, introduce platform for tournaments and environment for tournaments which is really cool and I will take a uh, talk a little more about it uh, further then we create uh, we introduce blockchain to esports which is really innovative because we know how uh, blockchain is popular now and how much Bitcoin costs now and also uh, we propose some really innovative ways to communicate your brand with esports audience and it's really important as well because old ways of advertising might not work as good as they did before so we introduced really special here i will talk a bit later about uh, blockchain tournaments but let's start with advertising let's start when the fun begins for instance if you play counter strike and it is one of the most popular games in the world uh, we can uh, promote your product right within the game so we can place banners let's say if you sell water or whatever uh, we can say drink water play better shoot better be more specific so it, it, it's kind of cool we can I don't know we can put like three meter three meter high bottle or put a car if you sell a car right within the map and this is how you engage with esports audience because they are millennials they're young they sick of uh, classical banners and advertising and they look for something fresh creative fun and you and that's what we present to you but let's talk about more advertising opportunities uh, a bit later. I want to give you a short overview about esports market. So, esports market is computer gaming, is competitive computer gaming. It's like chess or football, but when you play computer in computer games and you, uh, there's nothing gambling or stuff like this. You just, uh, it's game of skills competition. It's game of skills competition have uh, really huge revenues because recently we see that uh, oh much better uh, we see that this year overall revenue of esports market is 700 million dollars and analytics say that to 2020 we'll see 1.5 billion year revenue in esports so the esports market is not growing it's booming it's hugely running forward and increasing every numbers which is connected to the market the next number which we can discuss in the market is of course audience because audience is we know that over half a billion people play or watch esports today and 1.5 billion people in the market know about esports 1.5 billion people in the world know about esports it's huge it's some numbers are even bigger than in traditional sports let's say if we take betting numbers uh, betting amounts on esports it's much higher than in nfl so you can see how huge it is and these numbers show us that in esports we're moving from millions to billions and that's enormous numbers that's enormous market which you can enter as a esports project what is more exciting in esports is of course a feel of competition it's opportunity to win it's opportunity to compete and demonstrate your skills and demonstrate that you are best in the world uh, everything in esports is moving and is organized around esports tournaments because tournaments are the most interesting the most exciting events to watch and more most revenue uh, generation uh, generated uh, events uh, the last year overall price pools in esports competitions was near one million dollars and this number growing from year to year unfortunately but maybe fortunately but here's opportunity where here where is opportunity lies the most numbers which are generated by these tournaments are or offline tournaments so this land tournaments uh, there are huge gap in online tournaments there are bigger audience there are millions of players there are hundreds of brands who want to conduct esports tournaments and who want to participate in esports tournaments and everything is uh, circling around these tournaments for instance in Illa play we 
have any team a uh, guy who is champion of the world in counter strike and he give us advisory on how should should be taken nowadays typical online tournament is 1000 2000 like 5000 maybe dollars per one but if there will be a platform which conducts a tournament for fifty thousand dollars or one hundred thousand dollars it shakes the market immediately and everyone in esports world will know about this tournament and every player in the world who plays any particular game will want to come to this platform and participate in this tournament and compete in this tournament. Imagine what opportunity uh, will you have if you will, ha if you will have your logo on this tournament or your, you have your brand in the map. It's a huge opportunity for brands as well. Oops. So. Uh, let's back. Let's get back to our platform. That's where opportunity is. Uh, our platform is 18 months years old. It's really young and it's really emerging. It's an environment for online tournaments. Uh, for this year, we run set of tests of users, set of tournaments tests. We implemented four games. We implemented different tournaments regimes and stuff like this to great, great, great space for players to compete and over this year we paid the ten thousand dollars rewards for players who compete and we see the real interest from gaming audience and we see re real interest from them and now the next plan of our platform to move from existing markets to new markets to extend to grow to get fuel to our engine and to go full throttle to conquer new markets that's the option so and as I said, we have a fantastic platform, which is ecosystem for brands who want to enter and conduct tournaments for players to, for, and for our platform who all also does these tournaments and who also does uh, organize these prize funds. Uh, we organize prize funds on blockchain. Here is where blockchain lies. We do transparent transactions uh, to sponsors, to players, and to prize pool distribution. So everything is transparent to player, to players, and to brands, and to platform. Everything is works all all cryptocurrency, which is also good in terms of recent market uh, uh, market development, and it's really cool. But of course. Every business should be built around revenue. There's no business without revenue. And we have a clear plan where these revenues will come from. First of all, and we know that around 90% of all revenues in today's esports comes from brands and advertisers. And that's what we're creating, the new opportunity for brands and advertisers to come to esports, to communicate in a new way to very sweet esports audience and to promote their brands, to communicate their brands to their audience. The audience of esports is uh, not 15 years old players like from schools, which we used to know. It's already grown up from 20 to 35 years old with income more than average, who are ready to spend on esports, who are ready to bet, who are ready to use their funds on esports. So it's, uh, it starts with sponsored tournaments and advertising to esports audience, which we provide various ways as you see it can be in-game product placement it can be video integrations maybe some classical ways will work too but we're looking for innovative way to give something special to audience to play us of course it's also an opportunity for players to get more data from the platform because we analyze users behavior in-game behavior how players how teams play and if you have a membership you can know more about your competitors and you can get prepared well for tournaments on the platform like you do in classic sport if you play a football game you should know everything about your competitor like it's in gaming like it's, like it's in business like it's in classic sport here in esports it comes the same and of course betting we want uh, we look to implement betting on games who which are played on elo play platform and for major esports tournaments around the world these bets of course will be based on blockchain will which are transparent which use own cryptocurrency and this cryptocurrency will uh, follow the demand of all players and brands who come to platform and the more the higher is demand the higher is the price so here is the very specific segmented product for this particular market and that's what i say here's a will be a unknown cryptocurrency for ELA play which will open new opportunities for players and for everyone who is connected to the brand ELA play is emerging company and we just passed the angel level of investments and we're looking for more investments to get uh, forward to add new markets to ourselves and to uh, increase uh, user base 
uh, to develop, we have a very specific roadmap for next two years, and we have various waves of ways of improvement for giving something special to esports and to our product as well. First of all, as I said, we want to hold huge esports tournaments online, which will gather not like five, ten teams, which are typically happens offline, but which will gather hundred, five hundred, even thousand teams online can be uh, participate in tournaments and compete for one thousand dollars and. This this is a fantastic opportunity for all players because if you just average team, you will never come to esports tournament offline. But if you have this opportunity to come and play online, that's that's exactly for you, and that's what you need. That's what you will look for. Then, uh, as I said already, all the prizes will be formed in esports cryptocurrency, which is also exciting for young people because young people love new things like new phones, new tablets, everything, and new cryptocurrency. It's not typical old points which you just uh, get, but it's something new. Today you got uh, like ten dollars, tomorrow it costs fifteen dollars, but you already want it and you have opportunity to operate this. This is really cool for young people. Then. Uh, a few words about marketing of our product because it's very specific. Uh, typically, when you have one product, you have only one stream of marketing. In our case, we already have four games. Four games which are tens of millions of players monthly of these games. And this is like four different products. So we have four different streams of marketing and advertising. And adding new game, each new game to the platform, which can be added like every three months or so, uh, gives you millions of new players for the platform and gives you new advertising opportunities. So we can grow, grow at the same time on the same ways. New games, new gaming consoles, new gaming platforms like Xbox, PlayStation, and, and others. And of course, coming to new markets, which are really excited about esports we know that esports is extremely popular in asia in europe in united states everywhere so every new market every new game gives you millions of new players and millions of potential revenue to come uh, and of course as again i say is esports betting which also will give a huge revenue boost because esports betting market is bigger than esports market itself and it's a really huge opportunity to get to invest and to get revenue as the as the project uh, Elo Play is uh, moving the right way we are young product we have uh, straight pen how to what to bring to esports what to bring to gaming what to bring to blockchain and to cryptocurrency market and that's what our products is thank you thank you